G'day, this is Mike Smith for Sioma Websites and today we're having a look at a curious thing that happened recently with WordPress. I noticed that uh, I wasn't able to access revisions on a page or a post whereas previously I had and so I did a bit of um, detective work to find out what it was so this video shows you how to fix that problem and get your revisions back. Okay, now to show you what I mean uh, I'm going to uh, use a, a brand new installation of WordPress here on the free WooCommerce storefront theme. Um, so we're just going to use this sample page here and edit it. Uh, okay, so pressing the edit button here. Now the revisions would normally be um, visible below the edit box and you should be able to use the screen options here to bring down the options and uh, revisions should be uh, visible here to select or not select but it's not visible here so what's going on let's have a look at it okay so what are revisions well WordPress is capable of storing um, the versions of each page or post going back as long as you like um, and in previous versions that seemed to be turned on automatically but in uh, more recent versions of WordPress it seems to have been removed but you can put it back in however you do need to enter oh, there's a couple of ways of doing it but the way that I would prefer to do it is entering this line of code in a file called wp-config you wouldn't normally be able to find that file um, unless you're, uh, you get into your website hosting using a file manager okay so in the um, in the C panel um, you would find a file manager and then you would navigate to this WP wp-config.php file then you would edit that and you'd be looking for a line like this um, define WP post revisions and if if that line doesn't exist that could explain why you're not getting revisions if it does exist and if this number here is zero that means the revisions are turned off as per the, um, the instructions here okay um, false do not store any revisions except for the one autosave per post um, and if the um, if the um, if the value is minus one then store every revision and, and I think that was the default earlier as you can see it says that it's default but in this brand new installation it, it, it doesn't exist at all and then if it's an integer above zero it will re re store that many revisions so what you need to do is get into cPanel get into file manager get into this file and look for this line and if it doesn't exist type it in and then make sure this is a positive number or minus one minus one means store all revisions and say for example three would mean that it stores the last three revisions now I'm going to set mine to minus one because I do want to store all revisions um, then save it like that uh, and then we should be good to go and we'll test that in a moment okay so we've just saved this file um, with the uh, the new value here and uh, now what we need to do is force WordPress to re uh, reload this WP config file so um, let's just try a few things and see if that's enough we will well first what we'll do is we'll just refresh to this edit page and see if that works bring the screen options down oh yes that's enough okay so revisions are there now um, and it has remembered the previous two versions of of this file so it will only um, I, it will only store um, revisions from the time that you turn revisions on so uh, so that's something to bear in mind and this may not be visible until you actually make a change for the first time to a file so that that may also be a little bit confusing okay so that's all there is to it just um, Recapping, um, we we uh, if if we're looking for revisions here and this box is not there, um, the instructions are here in the uh, WordPress.org codex under revisions. See there, revisions there, um, and then we need to get into cPanel via File Manager, 
to edit this WP config file and we're looking for this line if it doesn't exist we have to type it in if it does exist but with uh, the wrong value then we change that minus one is store all or any positive integer is store that many okay and that's it thanks very much for watching